Heptapolis, International Green City, Global Geometrical Model. The history of our solar system has no scientifically proven beginning. However, the perfection of its operation leads to the conclusion that it had no beginning and that it is eternal, for perfection has no beginning and no end. The quest for the principles that govern perfection constitutes the highest expression of human knowledge. When Pythagoras taught his students, he urged them to observe carefully nature, humanity and the universe and to compare the movements, forms and styles on the basis of single digit numbers and geometric shapes. The golden number which constituted the principles of the perfect form, the perfect shape and the perfect motion was 1.618. The Pythagorean architectural structures, the golden number and the cosmic meter from the main pillars of creation of the Heptapolis. The universe of the celestial sphere with seven equal circles that adorn the area of a larger circle and together make up the holy tetractis of Pythagoras became the main model of the architectural creation of Heptapolis. In this steel likeness of the sacred tetractis of Pythagoras, we observe that if the universe is judged as unified, enclosed within its absolute monad, the four rays of the tetractis have bound the forces of the positive and the negative and all together certify the self-existent monad, the creator, God. Again, according to Pythagoras, when God decides to self-manifest, God becomes dual, male and female the generative substance of the absolute monad. When in the next move God wants to create nature, humanity and the world, God becomes triple. This is the physical, this is the human and this is the divine world. For the three Pythagorean worlds to function, the forces of the positive and the negative have to be separated, with the result that the opposite tendencies of these forces unite, thus constituting the principle for every form created. This Pythagorean model of the creation of the world became the geometric model of Heptapolis, with the cosmic and golden number 1.618 as the dominant measure in the relations of the structures, volumes, shapes and distances. Paul Pisanos created, along with a renowned researcher in Pythagoreanism, the civil engineer and mathematician Hippocrates Dacoglu, a dynamic team of inspired architects and engineers who labored for many months trying to construct and create a geometric city in which each structure, in relation to every other and in relation to the whole of the city, is connected by the golden number and at the same time a city that would be beautiful, classical, hospitable, livable and above all functional and sustainable so that the people who will inhabit it and work in it will feel happy and productive. For the study and purpose of each building of Heptapolis, Paul Pisanos enlisted academics, professors, historians, constitutional lawyers, judges, sociologists and professors of international relations, artists and in particular philosophers and persuaded them to work beside him without pay so as to conceive in its whole and in its parts a city of nations that can respond to all the evolving needs of every age, every society in the countries of East and West. The unprecedented zeal and love of an entire scientific army of Greeks who worship their homeland and seek the good of mankind brought after many years of hard work the unprecedented result of completing an enormous study of way of thought to solve the paramount problems of humanity by means of an international city.
It was never asked of any private or public entity to help finance the hundreds of associates who were members of the Olympos Association who worked on the drafting of the project proposal Heptapolis, dedicated to Earth and man, to every nation and every religion in the coming centuries.